crazy. vlogs off in my bathroom <laughs> so today it's gonna be an exciting vlog because i am on february break for school so ryan and i are taking a little trip we're going to portsmouth new hampshire so we got an airbnb in the city of portsmouth like downtown portsmouth but also it's really close to a beach and then it's also like really close to a mountain and we're gonna go snowboarding so it's like 12 o'clock and we're leaving in like an hour so I spent the whole morning packing. I got my Starbucks essential. I got some questions on my Starbucks order. I change it every time but this is the Grande Ice Caramel Brulee No Whip Cream Cold Brew. I got egg bites but I already ate those. I hope you guys are having a good weekend. It's Sunday right now. Is it Sunday? Yeah. Yeah. It's Sunday right now so we're going to be there Monday, Tuesday. And Wednesday, so just like a mini trip, but of course I'm overpacking. I have a whole pack with me video that I'll link here if you're curious like how I pack more in depth, but I'm not gonna do that in this vlog. I'm just wearing this like waffle knit TNA like crop from Aritzia and then some sweatpants from Brandy Melville to be comfy in the car. I'm a mess over here trying to pack, so I have my mini suitcase just because it's easy. I'm going to put all my clothes in here accessories underwear and hats and everything in here shoes and like my hair stuff over here um i gotta pack some coats i'm gonna bring my computer because i want to edit a vlog while i'm there this is like my bag of all my snowboarding stuff i need to make sure i have everything i might put it in my louis vuitton one instead I'm bringing a couple purses i don't know i'm stressed so we have time <laughs> yeah at least we have time we don't have to like catch a flight or anything we're just driving so i'm gonna take my time but i will Catch up with you guys when I'm done packing. This is my stoneboard stuff. Um, my board is so cute. I'm obsessed with her. Love her. And then I also have my boots that I always bring. Um, helmet. You need to wear a helmet if you go snowboarding or skiing. I don't care how good you are. Please wear your helmet. So I always have my helmet. I like my stuff to be like white. That's the theme we're going for. So I have my Burton gloves that are white. I'm bringing like this big face mask in case it's cold. Have like a little neck scarf, turtle fur scarf, some nice Under Armour thick socks. I have this Billabong thermal that I'm gonna wear, my North Face um, snowboarding pants. And I think I'm gonna bring, I also have my snowboarding goggles in here. I think I'm gonna bring leggings to wear under the pants in case it's really cold and probably like a sweatshirt to wear over the thermal under the coat. All right, so we are leaving now, finally. It's like already three o'clock, but we couldn't check in earlier anyway, so we're gonna leave now and take multiple trips because we have lots of stuff. Ryan's getting all the snowboards together. <laughs> yeah, baby. Oh, no, no. He already found a ball. Can you pay? There you go. Little townhouse. We just got to the Airbnb. It's so nice. I'm gonna give you guys a full tour. It's like a three story townhouse. So you walk in this door, and then there's just like this huge stairwell all the way up. This is the living room area, just like a couple sofas. Otto's like freaking out. <laughs> Some sofas, really cute. Look at this is like the original Macintosh computer. How cool is this? So old school. It's so cool. Kitchen area. It's like huge fridge. Probably won't even cook, but we could if we wanted to. 
little back door pato patio area. We can like let Otto out if we want. Coming back down here, this is just little mini bathrooms down here. And then this is like a closet. There's so much space. This is like crazy. I wish I like lived here. Then coming up these huge stairs. So cute. This second floor. This is like another bathroom. Another bathroom and then there's like tub in here. Laundry room. In here. There's another bedroom. Like, we could have totally brought so many friends here. Closet. Then on this side, there is an office room. We could have, like, stayed here, did some work. Maybe I'll, like, edit some YouTube videos while I'm here. Another, like, guest bedroom. Another closet. Like, crazy. Then you come up to the third floor. And this is probably where we're gonna sleep. This is like the master bedroom. So you have the nice balcony area. Like all of the furniture is gorgeous in here. This huge TV and then the huge walk-in closet. Huge walk-in closet in here. It even has its own like sink area in the closet. And then look at this like beautiful door obsessed with that you come into the master bathroom this is like crazy the sinks are huge shower so nice look at this tub this is gorgeous and then the perfect perfect for me mirror right here to take some mirror outfit pics i'm obsessed with this place i like want to live here this is so nice i'll have all the details linked down below if you guys are ever in Portsmouth, New Hampshire and want to stay here, stay, it's right downtown. You can walk to the downtown area, all different shops, stores, like restaurants. It seems so cute. I cannot wait to explore tomorrow. So we just got here and we have a dinner reservation tonight at like seven. So I'm just gonna unpack and get ready and then we'll probably head downtown to go to dinner. Look at the sunset. It's so pretty. Mm, cotton candy skies. It's so pretty. I'm gonna prop you guys up right here while I do my makeup for dinner. I wish I was one of those people who could like talk and do my makeup at the same time, but I'm really bad at multitasking, so I'm gonna try my best. All right, I'm getting ready for dinner. And like I said, we have a reservation at a restaurant downtown at 7 and it's 5 30 so i gotta get going because i want to take some pictures but i'm just going in with my flawless filter charlotte tilbury first as a primer what are you guys doing i feel like i haven't talked to you in so long and i just feel like time is moving by so quickly like it's almost the end of february i just feel like i haven't had a second to myself to just like relax and like take life in honestly it's just like kind of sad i've just been swamped at work like work work with my nine to five and i just feel like i'm so spread thin and i'm trying to do like a million things at once and everything i do i can't do i'm like a perfectionist and everything i'm trying to do i can't do it perfectly because i just don't have time and that's really stressing me out so that's kind of like my status with life right now but also i just feel so happy like i feel like i'm doing everything that i love everything that i can to do what i love and things have been going well for me and like working out for me in different ways i'm really trying to just focus on the positives because it can be so easy to get down on yourself and be hard on yourself but I really have to like think back, even to like last year, like if last year me could see myself right now, the growth and just like the progress I've made 
just with like everything like i'm talking just my life as a whole i don't know i'm like really proud of myself here's your reminder to stop being hard on yourself and praise yourself for all the small amazing accomplishments that happen to you every day because it can be hard oh my god i thought this wasn't recording now so i'm like are you kidding me my tinted moisturizer on top of the flawless filter during the day i don't normally but since we're going out tonight i want to make sure everything looks good i want to hear how you guys are doing so let me know in the comments like one thing that's happened to you recently that you're just like really proud of or really excited about I'm, like so <laughs> sometimes i like hate filming get ready with me because i'm so aggressive with how i put on my makeup like i'm literally like hitting my face but i just i gotta do it quick like I'm very, I'm a fast paced person. I like cannot take my time with things sometimes. I'm gonna go in with my NARS. I'm running out of both of them, but these are two different shades. The light 2.3 and medium zero. So I kind of just mix them just because I'm like running out. dry so I don't want to put on a powder I'm gonna put on this like merit stick for my contour today what did you get me uh, salt and vinegar chips Buffalo Ranch oh. party bites and a high noon. Oh my god, a high noon? Uh huh, I got a high noon too. Oh my god. Um, I haven't eaten since my egg bites this morning and I'm like, my anxiety is so bad because I drink coffee and I just, I need something in my stomach. So Ryan got me some chips to hold me over. And a high noon. Are you drinking a high noon? Yeah. Oh. Wow, getting crazy. PJI Fridays party bites. Mmm, it's pretty good. I've been seeing so many people get their eyebrows like microbladed lately, just like my um, YouTube friends and stuff. And I would love to do that for myself because mine are so blonde and thin, but I don't know. I'm, I'd be like way too scary. I think I'm actually gonna use the Charlotte Tilbury like matte lip tonight. Pillow top lip liner, the matte lipstick, and then my Merit lip oil and Bel Air over top. All right, here is the finished look. I'm bringing my little green Simbono bag because it matches the top I'm wearing perfectly. I just have some leather pants and my docks and i was looking for an excuse to wear this little crop top from pepper mayo so i think this is such a cute dinner fit i don't know how people dress around here i'll probably get weird looks but it's fine makeup just came out nice and dewy and natural so total dark That's like what I want. <laughs> Four is perfect. Yeah, me. All right, go ahead. 